How about an autograph center? Can't shoot him if it's this Sir, Poxy, sir. Look, I got my end covered. Just get me some backup ASAP. I don't want to rot on this mud ball forever. You needn't soil yourself, my cantinas. I have no intention of ending my illustrious career as a fleet commander of the Fuhrer of Empire on this execrable boondock of a planet. We'll be out of here in nanos. Oh, you see? Someone on the Fuhrer homeworld has already picked up our transmission. Come in, please. I say again, this is Space Traffic Control. Your signal has been received. Come in, please. Yes, hello. This is Orthopox 13 of the Fuhrer Empire transmitting from Sol 3. Say again? Orthopox 13 of the Fuhrer Empire. Imperial Fleet Commander Orthopox 13. Never heard of you. Never heard of you. I'm Orthopox 13, man! Me, Orthopox 13! Conqueror of Zarkon Mai, hero of the Battle of Tharsis Mons, winner of the Xanthrax 47 Mental Cruelty Award, six years running, I'm the second most senior fleet commander in the entire Fuhrer Navy! I was enslaving hyperdimensional insectoids in the dung hills of Beetleblatt when you were still in short pants! And you... Now, what's your license number? My what? Your license number. All pilots cleared to fly outside the Furon systems are issued an official flight license by Space Traffic Control. Well, I've been out of the system. I'm away in deep space on a mission of vital importance to the Furon Empire. Right. Where did you say you were transmitting from? So... Earth. Galactic Arm Delta Sector 13. Did I mention my mission is essential to the very survival of the Furon race? I'm sure it's important to you, sir. I can do without the sarcasm, mister. Look, perhaps I should just speak to your supervisor. Sector 13, Sector 13. Oh, here it is, Sector 13. No, that can't be right. Well, there's practically nothing there. The Russian war wiped out every significant life form in the system. Only one planet left with a sense of life, and that's Sector 13. Oh, yeah, that's right. Sector 13. I didn't fall and break my hip. 
What in the hell can emergency services do?
go. They want their space. Is being Must done. reacquire target.
Can I help you, soldier? I've been on, uh, leave. Uh, uh, how's old General Armquist? That loony? Dead. You know he tried to blow up one of our bases in the 50s. Yeah, uh, I heard that. So, uh, how about that battle over... Uh, uh, we, we, we gave him what for, huh? Yeah, we sure did, man. But it's times like this I wish for the good old days. Well, what days would those be? When guys knew their civic duty. The next hippie I catch dodging a draft is gonna spit polish my boots till they shine! From inside his ass! Ew. You sound a little tense. Anything I can do? Yeah. Bring a hippie named Clayton Cartwell Jr. into the depot. Seems to me that an AWOL hippie like Clayton Cartwell Jr. would think to hide somewhere. Seems to me that an AWOL hippie like Clayton Cartwell Jr. would think to hide somewhere north of Coit Tower. But I'm not a hippie. What do I know? Thought paid for by friends of Clayton Cartwell Jr. Who'd want to go to war just to line the pockets of the military industrial complex, man? Clayton's my hero! Sticking it to the man! They're all staring. I can tell. Who'd want to go to war? Just to line the pockets of the who'd want to go to war? Just to line the pockets of the military industrial complex, man. Clayton's my hero. Sticking it to the man. Good thing he's holed up north of Coit Tower. Buzz never go up there. Boom. The dream is always the I've got a secret plan to get us out of Vietnam by Christmas. Why won't anybody listen? You're going down. Oh dare those hippies refuse to be drifted. Oh dare those hippies refuse to be drifted. Oh dare those hippies refuse to be drafted. It seems to me that an AWOL hippie like Clayton Cartwell Jr. would think to hide somewhere north of Coit Tower. But I'm not a hippie. What do I know? Thought paid for by friends of Clayton Cartwell Jr. <laughs> <laughs> You don't- ah! You throw us!
share of those hippies refuse to be drafted. If they're not willing to go die young in a foreign country that poses no threat whatsoever to the United States, then what good are they? No! Leave me alone! Capitalist Svolich, you will not be drafting small hippie man! Tax returns to file. Oh, my God. 